The controversy surrounding Trump-Russia collusion has been one of the most significant and divisive issues in American politics in recent years. The allegations that members of the Trump campaign colluded with Russian officials to interfere in the 2016 presidential election have sparked intense debate and investigation. Supporters of President Donald Trump argue that the accusations are baseless and politically motivated, while critics argue that there is ample evidence to suggest collusion occurred. This article will delve into the various aspects of the controversy, examining the evidence, the implications for American democracy, and what may happen next. The Mueller Investigation A Brief Overview The Mueller Investigation, officially known as the Special Counsel Investigation, was launched in May 2017 by then-Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein. Its purpose was to investigate Russian interference in the 2016 election and any potential links or coordination between the Trump campaign and Russia. Led by special counsel Robert Mueller, a former FBI director, the investigation has been wide-ranging and has resulted in numerous indictments and guilty pleas. The scope of the investigation has included examining contacts between Trump campaign officials and Russian individuals, as well as looking into potential obstruction of justice by President Trump himself. The investigation has faced criticism from some who argue that it is politically motivated and a witch hunt against the president. However, others argue that it is a necessary step to ensure the integrity of American democracy and hold those responsible for any wrongdoing accountable. The smoking gun. What is it? In the context of the Trump-Russia collusion scandal, a smoking gun refers to definitive evidence that proves collusion occurred. It is often used metaphorically to describe evidence that is so compelling that it leaves no doubt about someone's guilt or involvement in a particular act. In the case of Trump-Russia collusion, many have been searching for a smoking gun that definitively proves that members of the Trump campaign conspired with Russian officials to interfere in the 2016 election. However, as of yet, no smoking gun has been found. While there have been numerous pieces of evidence that suggest collusion may have occurred, such as the Trump Tower meeting and the DNC hack, there is no single piece of evidence that conclusively proves it. The Trump Tower meeting, evidence of collusion. One of the most significant pieces of evidence in the Trump-Russia collusion scandal is the infamous Trump Tower meeting. In June 2016, Donald Trump Jr., along with Jared Kushner and Paul Manafort, met with a Russian lawyer named Natalia Veselnitskaya who claimed to have damaging information about Hillary Clinton. The meeting was arranged after Trump Jr. was promised dirt on Clinton in an email from a British publicist named Rob Goldstone. While the meeting itself did not provide a smoking gun, it raised serious questions about potential collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia. The fact that high-level members of the campaign were willing to meet with a Russian lawyer who claimed to have damaging information about their political opponent suggests a willingness to accept help from a foreign adversary. Additionally, the subsequent attempts by members of the Trump team to downplay and mislead about the meeting raised further suspicions. The DNC hack, a connection to Russia. Another piece of evidence that suggests a connection between the Trump campaign and Russia is the hacking of the Democratic National Committee, DNC, during the 2016 election. In July 2016, it was revealed that Russian hackers had gained access to the DNC's email servers and had stolen thousands of emails. These emails were later released by WikiLeaks, causing significant damage to the Clinton campaign. The intelligence community has concluded that the hacking was carried out by Russian intelligence agencies as part of a broader effort to interfere in the election. While there is no direct evidence linking the Trump campaign to the hacking, the fact that the stolen emails were released at a time when they would be most damaging to Clinton suggests a potential coordination between the hackers and the campaign. This has led to speculation that members of the Trump team may have been aware of or involved in the hacking. The Steele dossier, proof of collusion? One of the most controversial aspects of the Trump-Russia collusion scandal is the Steele dossier. Compiled by former British intelligence officer Christopher Steele, the dossier contains a series of memos that allege a wide-ranging conspiracy between the Trump campaign and Russia. The dossier includes claims that Russian officials had compromising information on Trump, that there were ongoing contacts between the campaign and Russian operatives, and that there was a quid pro quo agreement between Trump and Russia. The dossier has been a subject of intense debate and scrutiny since its publication. Some argue that it provides compelling evidence of collusion, while others dismiss it as unverified and politically motivated. While some aspects of the dossier have been corroborated, much of it remains unverified. As such, it cannot be considered definitive proof of collusion. However, it does provide a roadmap for investigators and has played a significant role in shaping public perception of the scandal. Trump's business ties to Russia, a conflict of interest. Another aspect of the Trump-Russia collusion scandal is President Trump's business ties to Russia. Throughout his career as a real estate developer, Trump has had numerous business dealings with Russian individuals and entities. These ties have raised concerns about potential conflicts of interest and whether they may have influenced his actions as president. 
Critics argue that Trump's business interests in Russia may have made him susceptible to Russian influence or compromised his ability to act in the best interests of the United States. They point to his efforts to build a Trump Tower in Moscow during the 2016 campaign as evidence of this. Supporters of the president argue that his business ties are irrelevant and that there is no evidence to suggest they have influenced his decision-making. Russian interference in the 2016 election. What we know. While the focus of the Trump-Russia collusion scandal has been on potential collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia, it is important to also consider the broader issue of Russian interference in the 2016 election. The intelligence community has concluded that Russia engaged in a multifaceted campaign to undermine American democracy and help Donald Trump win the presidency. Russian interference took many forms, including hacking and releasing emails, spreading disinformation on social media, and targeting state election systems. The extent of the impact of this interference is still being debated, but there is no doubt that it had a significant effect on the election. Understanding the full scope of Russian interference is crucial to understanding the context in which potential collusion may have occurred. The role of social media in the collusion scandal. One of the key tools used by Russia in its efforts to interfere in the 2016 election was social media. Russian operatives created fake accounts and used bots to spread disinformation and sow discord among American voters. They targeted swing states and key demographics with messages designed to inflame political tensions and undermine trust in democratic institutions. The role of social media in the collusion scandal cannot be overstated. It provided a platform for Russian operatives to reach millions of Americans with their propaganda and disinformation. It also allowed them to target specific individuals and communities with tailored messages designed to influence their opinions and behavior. The impact of this manipulation on the election is still being studied, but it is clear that social media played a significant role in shaping public opinion. The implications of collusion for American democracy. The potential implications of collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia for American democracy are far-reaching. At its core, collusion represents a betrayal of the democratic process and undermines the integrity of elections. If members of the Trump campaign conspired with a foreign adversary to interfere in the 2016 election, it raises serious questions about the legitimacy of Trump's presidency and the fairness of the electoral process. Collusion also erodes trust in institutions and the rule of law. If those in power are seen as corrupt or willing to subvert democratic norms for personal gain, it undermines faith in the system as a whole. This can have long-lasting effects on public trust and engagement in politics, potentially leading to increased polarization and a breakdown of democratic norms. What happens next? The Trump-Russia collusion scandal has been a source of intense debate and investigation since it first came to light. The Mueller investigation has resulted in numerous indictments and guilty pleas, but as of yet, no smoking gun has been found that definitively proves collusion occurred. The investigation is ongoing, and it remains to be seen what its final conclusions will be. The implications of the collusion scandal for American democracy are significant. If collusion is proven, it would represent a betrayal of the democratic process and raise serious questions about the legitimacy of Trump's presidency. It would also have broader implications for trust in institutions and the rule of law. As the investigation continues, it is crucial that Americans remain engaged and informed. The future of American politics may depend on holding those responsible for any wrongdoing accountable and taking steps to ensure that such interference does not happen again. Only by addressing the issues raised by the collusion scandal can America move forward and strengthen its democracy for future generations. For more details on Trump and the conspiracy theories surrounding him, read Trump Unmasked, Conspiracy and Power on Amazon. Order your copy in paperback form or ebook format.